BYD will release the first hardcore off-road vehicle Yangwang U8, which may be an epoch-making landmark product in the history of global electric vehicle development, and it is also BYD's killer feature. We often say that Tesla has redefined electric vehicles. Then, the appearance of BYD Yangwang U8 is pulling back the tradition of mechanical performance of electric cars. Tesla told us that we must make intelligent electric cars. BYD Yangwang, on the other hand, tells everyone that it is not necessary to be intelligent to make electric cars, but to make mechanization to the extreme first, which can also bring disruptive product experience. BYD Yangwang U8 is a disruptive product based on the electrification technology, which elevates the mechanization performance of the car to a whole new level. It is the first time that electric cars surpass fuel cars in terms of mechanization performance. Simply put, the emergence of the Yangwang U8 has completely broken the mechanical performance advantage of fuel cars in terms of technology. Wind and rain, mountains, and water are no longer off-limits to electric cars, and the Yangtze U8 breaks the zone. In today's video, let's take a look at this latest BYD product that's shocking the world. What impressive advanced technology does it have? Ok, let's take a look. In BYD's promotional video, we can clearly see that the Yangwang U8 has four new driving experiences, first, driving horizontally like a crab, second, making a 360-degree U-turn in place, third, traversing the desert, and fourth, being able to float and drive on water. These four scenarios are all upgrades to the mechanized performance of the car. It does not promote automatic driving, nor does it talk about intelligent cockpit, nor does it talk about how many screens it has. It just tells everyone honestly, what a fuel car can do, I can do, and what a fuel car can't do, I can do. I have repeatedly mentioned in past videos that BYD may be behind the times in the second half of intelligence. But what I never expected was that BYD simply does not specialize in intelligence in the first half. It focused on doing electrification in the first half, using electrification technology to improve the mechanical performance of the car. And the new technology to achieve all this, is the world's original new technology. The so-called E4, simply put, it uses four motors to control the four wheels of the car, each wheel is independently controlled. This brings a lot of unique experiences to the product. First, it has four tires, and even if two of them blow out, it ensures the stability of the car and the safety of its occupants. This is the same as adding an extra set of body stability control system within the electric car. Secondly, if you accidentally fall into the water and drive into a pond. You can use the four motors to drive the tires to increase the buoyancy of the car and make it float thus realizing the function of sailing in water. The other two driving experiences are the aforementioned go sideways like a crab and turn around 360 degrees in place. These two driving modes can expand the car's driving safety in extreme road conditions and not be helpless in very narrow passages. In short, the biggest technical innovation of U8 is that it fills the defect of insufficient mechanization performance of electric vehicles, and brings the mechanization performance of electric vehicles to the extreme. This is probably the biggest killer of BYD in the first half of the electric car race. We all know it's tough to create a new million-dollar luxury brand. Tesla Model X focuses on intelligence, sold to a price of one million, but also opened the door to the market of a million luxury cars. If BYD Yangwang follows Tesla, to engage in intelligence, it is difficult to surpass Tesla. BYD Yangwang U8 uses electricity to reshape the mechanical performance of the car, and it does not pay attention to autonomous driving. On the contrary, what it has always emphasized is that the human driving experience must not be ignored. After all, adapting to various terrains and road conditions, which are difficult for automatic driving. In addition, if the car falls into the water, the intelligent driving system will completely fail. The appearance of BYD Yangwang U8 brought the mechanical performance of the vehicle back to the first sequence. 
It also brings another benefit, which allows car companies to reduce their dependence on high-performance chips, use the power system to achieve the ultimate mechanical performance, and use mechanical performance to improve the stability and safety of electric vehicles. This is a return to the original original function of the car, as well as the practicability of the car. BYD Yang Wang has opened up an original road of its own. Therefore, autonomous driving technology has encountered the most primitive mechanical challenges in the competition among car companies. It tells us again, cars are for driving, not for playing. Rather than handing over the steering wheel to an immature artificial intelligence, it is better to hold it in your own hands. BYD Young Wang has announced that the price will be in the 1 million range. If you look closely, you will find that BYD Young Wang is almost invincible in the million level price range. Traditional fuel vehicles such as Toyota Domineering, Mercedes Benz G, Porsche Panamera, and BMW X7 cannot surpass BYD in technology. BYD Young Wang U8 has reshaped the power system of the car and it is no longer obsessed with the traditional two-wheel drive or four-wheel drive. It is independent four-wheel drive. Have you ever seen a DJI quadcopter drone? If traditional fuel vehicles are compared to single-rotor or dual-rotor UAVs, then BYD Yang Wang is a quad-rotor UAV. The four wheels are equivalent to four flying wings. They are independent of each other but cooperate with each other. This undoubtedly subverts the power system of electric vehicles. The technology not only makes BYD far ahead of other domestic car companies in China, but also defeats Tesla in terms of extreme mechanization performance. The intelligent technology that Tesla is proud of has encountered a strong challenge from primitive mechanization. Therefore, from the perspective of the positioning of a million-level luxury brand, BYD Young Wang's pioneering technology should help it gain a firm foothold in the high-end car market. At this moment, if Musk lets go of Tesla and ignores it, he will suffer a big loss after all. In addition, in my opinion, BYD's biggest setback is its brand power. Young Wang is a new brand, and compared with century-old European and American brands, there is a significant gap in brand power. At present, Young Wang's sales target cannot be positioned to defeat Mercedes-Benz, BMW, and Porsche, but to capture its first batch of seed users. They must have the first batch of seed users to pay for BYD Young Wang. This is the first step for any new brand to gain a foothold in the world. A journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step, and BYD Young Wang has just started to enter the million-dollar luxury car market. Wang Chuanfu said at the press conference, the first half of electric vehicles is electrification, and the second half is intelligence. In the first half of the competition, BYD's performance was undoubtedly perfect. He seems to be implying that even with the intelligence in the second half, BYD is also making big moves. Okay, that's all for today. Please put your comments below, and share your insightful ideas with other people. Do you want to learn about more auto stories? Please keep following our channel and like our videos. Thank you so much for your continuous support. Your precious time with us is highly appreciated. See you.